the Indian two-wheeler market will soon witness the arrival of new retro-style motorcycles. Previously, we brought you a list of upcoming Royal Enfield motorcycles that will be launched in the Indian market and you can find the link to that video in the description below. Here we bring you another list of upcoming retro motorcycles that are expected to reach our shows in the foreseeable future. Yamaha India will soon update its product portfolio with the launch of its retro-style 150cc motorcycle, the FZX. The motorcycle is inspired by the Yamaha XSR range that is sold in several international markets. We have already got a close glimpse at the upcoming Yamaha FZX through spy photographs and its resemblance with the XSR 150 is instantly evident. The styling cues on the upcoming FZ series model will include a round full LED headlight, a boxy fuel tank with black strip on the top, a single piece saddle and an engine cowl. The FZX does pack a rugged persona that is amplified through features such as dual purpose tires and fork gaiters. Spy images have revealed that the FZX will be available in at least three color options, black, blue and orange. The details about the instrument cluster are scarce at the moment, although we expect to see a fully digital unit on the FZX. Mechanical specifications would be similar to the existing FZ series and the FZX will use a 149cc single cylinder engine that would deliver 12.2 bhp of maximum power and 13.6 newton meters of peak torque. The hardware too will be similar to the FZFI range and thus the shock absorption tasks would be handled by telescopic forks at the front and a monoshock at the back. The braking setup would include single discs on both the ends while the safety net would include a single channel ABS. Yamaha has sent out media invites for an upcoming launch that is scheduled on 18th June 2021. While the company has not stated the product name, we expect to see the launch of the Yamaha FZX on the aforementioned date. Expect the newest member of the FZ range to carry a price premium above the existing models. KTM India brought the Hushkwarna brand to our shows with the launch of the Swat Pillin 250 and the Wit Pillin 250. The quarter litre motorcycles are expected to be joined by their biggest siblings in the country soon. Similar to the Swat Pillin 250, the upcoming Swat Pillin 401 will feature a scrambler style design. The motorcycle will pack rugged looks along with minimalistic body panels, upright ergonomics and dual purpose tyres. But unlike the 250cc model, the Swat Pillin 401 will get wire spoked wheels. The Hushkwarna 40 range will be based on the KTM 390 Duke. Thus, it will pack hardware such as trellis frame, WP sourced upside down front forks, a rear monoshock, disc brakes on both the wheels and Biber sourced calipers. The feature list will comprise of full LED lighting, a digital instrument cluster and ride by wire throttle. Mechanical specifications would include a 373cc single cylinder liquid cooled engine that will be derived from the 390 Duke. We expect the power and torque output numbers to be similar to the KTM Naked Roadster and the Hushkwana Swat Pillin 401 should produce 43 bhp of power and 37 newton meters of peak torque. Similar to the 390 Duke, the 6 speed gearbox will benefit from a slipper clutch function. The 390 Duke and the 390 Adventure get a quick shifter and we may see the feature on the Hushkwana 401 series too. The official launch timeline for the Hushkwana Swat Pillin 401 is not available yet although we could see the motorcycle on our shows in mid to late 2021. The motorcycle may arrive in 2.5 to 2.60 lakh egg showroom price range. The Swat Pillin 401 Scrambler will be joined by the Hushkwana with Pillin 401 Cafe Racer. The underpinnings would be identical on both the 401 models, although the two motorcycles would be distinguished through their respective styling. The road bias with Pillin 401 will feature clip-on style handlebar for a more committed rider strangle. Similar to the Swat Pillin 401, the Cafe Racer will use wire spoked units, although they would be wrapped in road bias tyres. The mechanical specifications, as mentioned before, would be similar to the Swat Pillin 401 and the Wit Pillin 401 will use a 390 Duke sourced 373cc single cylinder liquid cooled engine. The power and torque output numbers would remain at 43 bhp and 37 newton meters. The launch timeline for the Hushkwana 401 models is not available yet, although we could see these motorcycles on our shows in mid to late 2021. Similar to the existing quarter litre Hushkwarna models, the Swat Pillin 401 and the Wit Pillin 401 would be sold and serviced by the KTM outlets in the country. Expect these motorcycles to arrive at a relatively lower price tag than the KTM 390 Duke, which retails at 2.76 lakh rupees.
Last on the list is a new product that will come from Classic Legends. The Mahindra subsidiary will further expand its product portfolio by reviving the Yazdi brand in India. Patent documents have confirmed that the upcoming Yazdi motorcycle will be called the Road King. The details about the Yazdi model are scarce at the moment, although a spy photograph has revealed that the upcoming motorcycle will feature a scrambler-esque design. The motorcycle will ride on wire spoke wheels that would be wrapped in dual purpose tires. Further enhancing its rugged styling are the gaiters on the front forks. The spy images have also revealed styling elements such as round headlight at the front, a curvy fuel tank, a single piece saddle with ribbed seat cover, and rear fender mounted number plate. Mechanical specifications are scarce, although this upcoming YSD will use a single cylinder liquid cooled setup. The hardware on the YSD motorcycle will feature telescopic front forks, twin sided rear springs, and disc brakes on both the ends. The test mule appeared to be in early stages of development, and the production ready model might be some time away. Classic Legends introduced all Java motorcycles in the month of November and it will be interesting to see if the company follows a similar strategy for the Yazdi brand. If yes, we could see the new Yazdi Road King in our market by the end of 2021. Those are the motorcycles that we expect to see in the foreseeable future. Which motorcycles from this list excites you the most? Do let us know through comment section. Make sure to subscribe to our channel and hit the bell icon to stay notified every time we post a new video.